facing Greenberg in November will be Republican Bill Deereth, the J-Town mayor. Deereth with the vote on your screen. Take a look. Craig Greenberg coming in with 41% of the vote there. And Shamika Parrish Wright coming in second in tonight's contest, even beating David Nicholson, who was second behind uh, Craig Greenberg in raising money. Also, there's the total for Bill Deereth. 78% of the vote here tonight as we are tallying the mayor's race. We went again with WHS 11's Bobby McSwine. She is joining us live from O'Shea's in the Highlands will beard well, where Bill Dira thanked his supporters tonight. Bobby picking up our coverage here this evening. Yeah, Doug, I am here at O'Shea's where it's turned to a regular Tuesday night, but the crowd here for Bill Dira went from watching to celebrating as Dira became the Republican candidate facing off in Louisville's mayoral race in November, winning a very high number of votes. Bill Dareth, now the Republican candidate for Louisville's mayoral race, winning Tuesday's primary, running against three other GOP candidates. We can lead this community to where we are unified in purpose and realize what Louisville can be. His supporters out in full swing. Some own businesses in Jefferson Town and have seen Gareth in action as mayor there for 12 years. Before that, city council for 10. He's running for everybody in Louisville to make it a better place for everybody. He's got a good staff behind him. I just think he's, his principles are what we look for. The city of Louisville needs someone with the heart that Bill has because he's very passionate. Deereff says one of his top priorities is safety. He plans to bring along J-Town's chief of police, Rick Sanders, if he wins in November. We have to make this city a place where you will tell your friends from other places to come here because it's a place that you love and cherish. Deereff says he knows the road to November will be long, but says he's ready. I look forward to being your next mayor. Now, Dareth is already announcing his next move. He says on Friday he plans to meet with big cities across Kentucky, and in June he plans to do the same. Now, as we know, for decades Louisville has not had a Republican mayor, but Dareth says he prides himself on being bipartisan, and he says the vote count tonight shows he has what it takes to take it all in November. I'm live in Louisville. Bobby McSwine for the WHAS 1119 on your side.